Galo K. It is the one and only Ronan the Traveler. Man, I was walking around both the plot and walked right into the parade. But this is a good segue because one of the brothers that hit me up said, man, I'm coming to Port the Plata. Don't want to go to Sasua. Do you think I can meet decent women in uh, Port the Plata? Man, hell yeah, Port the Plata is not just famous for the stunning landmarks and, and the rich history, man. It's also a place of romance and new beginnings, man. Here, the warmth of the sun matches the warmth of the people, man. The people are cool as I don't know what. But listen, here's the thing. You're going to always have that, have men who've had bad experiences. I heard Mr. Flip Flop say that. When you hear men talking bad about a place, they usually got heartbroken, which can be true because I have bad things I done said about uh, America and I done been heartbroken in America before. Well, I did everything right and still got hit with the okie doke because in the U.S., man, women wield so much power. Look, and that's part of the reason why I left. Not that I could get anybody. I was just like, man, the 304 culture had just taken over the states in a major way. It tripped me out. Listen, in 2021, um, just right before I got my passport, my kids had just uh, left the house. They went to college. I ended a long-term relationship. I was free. It was just me and the dog in a four-bedroom house. And I'm looking at the wall. So I decided to go back into the dating world. Man, when I went back into the dating world, I was not equipped for what I was. Look, what I found, man, it was crazy. Man, 304 coach had run amok. The, the whole situation was just messed up. And I was like, man, this is what it got out here in these streets. I want to do, I need something better. So I got depressed, man. Had a bunch of money and dated a bunch of chicks in the States did, but they, they had more problems than these girls in the DR. Oh man, every chick I met in the States had some kind of problem. They were worse. I can understand. I look, I give it to a, a woman coming up from a developing country, but somebody in the richest country in the world, you struggling and you can't, man, come on, they had no excuse for it. So with me, I got depressed, man. Finally landed in Santo Domingo and my life had never been the same. And you know the story, man, y'all ain't even heard a fraction of the story times I got, man. And look, salute to all you brothers who are joining the membership. I'm gonna start putting a lot of stories on there because YouTube limits it. And shout out to all you brothers in the Blue Book Passport Cartel. I appreciate all you guys. So I'm telling you, man, coming and landing in Santo Domingo, having these experiences, then hitting Santiago and then hitting Porta Plata. Now, Porta Plata, man, is a different animal. It's a beautiful place, man, with beautiful culture. And let me tell you, the dating culture here thrives, man. I have met, met some genuine. The woman I'm with now, teacher, she's from this area. And when I first met her, man, she warm, welcoming. And I met her in the grocery store. And that's what I tell you guys, man. The best place to meet these women, man, is in these grocery stores. Man. It was natural. Um, you know, you got to deal with that first line. You're going to deal with the chopper, chopper, try to get your money. Then you're going to deal with the, you know, some of the working girls or whatever. And some men are, are cool with that. And I don't have a problem. I'm not the culture police. I'm not the dude. You know, them dudes on, on the Internet, them dudes make me sick sometimes. You need to travel for culture. Stop trying to travel for work. Man, you need to worry about yourself. I, I look at travel through the eyes of, hey, man, men are suffering you know let the men do what they do as long as they're not disrespecting the women not disrespecting and not disrespecting themselves man and look but culture is part of it understanding and embracing cultural differences is the key um the dominican approach to relationships man emphasizes family and tradition so something will take now nah, that's not true but i'm telling you as a person who lives here most of the time family is important once you get away because look here's the thing men don't understand even when you're dealing with some of these girls off the strip and everything how she act with you is not how she act with her family man the family and stuff is the key like a lot of these dudes they don't get the real experience they come have a little time and that's and that's cool if that's what you want but if you want to get to the real deal 
find you a solid chick because most men do man contrary to what a lot of these haters think about men you know the morality police guys that you got on on, on youtube most men that i talk to are looking for a good wife most of the men look here's the thing men want to be married western men want wives it's just listen western women don't want husbands they want the idea of having a husband then they're shaking you down that's why the whole high value thing goes out the window all that mean you get to you be you get high, high value make over a hundred thousand look i made over a hundred thousand for the last six years that ain't nothing let me tell you something all that is make you a target for people to come on you you see in the west all a woman got to do is say you did something i don't care if it happened in the 1970s it doesn't matter you are guilty what happened to innocent until proven guilty that's coming out the, out, out the window in the west so that's why you hear me push to my channel is a men's right channel i tell you guys man come enjoy this man come enjoy parades like this come enjoy this man and you're going to meet somebody any way to cut go um the dude's one about to date me it's going to happen but if you want line you something up and you're going to go through them you know i'm telling you man once you embark on that on that journey and 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 start sharing your stories love gonna find you man because a lot of the women here they're looking for the same thing and um hey, boy puerto plata got some beautiful ladies man oh my god this this same day we were sitting at a restaurant forgot the name of the restaurant maybe i put it in the shot i got pictures of it every woman in the restaurant was drop dead gorgeous but they had one in there look like a young lisa bonet and look i had to catch myself i'm in there with the family and i'm i told you guys man i like somebody i start hearing songs in my head i'm looking at her hearing the whispers just keep on loving me i said oh no don't do it now <laughs> i had to put the president thing now before i turned to the wolf and i'd have been on there in there so i gotta i got nah man it's family day calm down ronald we ain't doing none of that today but just the thing man for you guys that just coming this is where you need to be at it's close to united states man uh, man just the romantic sunset man the views this is where you need to be at so my call to action to any of you guys man is to get off that couch man because tell you something nobody cares about our state of mind men are depressed and this channel is to help you get out of that so that's why I meet a lot of guys, man. Look, I can't even meet up with so many of you guys. It's just too many now. It's, it's, it's growing. From I'm meeting guys in Santo Domingo, Puerto Plata, Sosua. I done met dudes in Santiago, La Vega. Man, the movement is growing. And you know how I got this new, what it is, the, the, on the B4 movement with these women. That's the thing. Why are our women the first women to always grab on to this? And this one I'm telling you guys about that cultural diversity. It's good sometimes to get away from black America, man. Or just America, period. But black America, man, it's good to get away from it, man. Like, when you get out of it, you see how flawed it is. And men, we can fix it, but they won't allow us to fix it. Once we start talking about the problem, you become the problem. So that's why I tell guys, man, save yourself seek your own fortune and this is how you're going to win i'm telling you you will you you come over here you're going to find more beautiful women more fit women more feminine women these women will take care of you let me tell you my girl cooks every day no matter if i tell her not to or whatever she just does it i like i'm no i have got mad with her many times and all the women i've had i've had a couple of relationships since 2021 i've had many solid relationships i just messed them up i always tell you guys i turn to the wolf sometimes now she understands that and i i'm chill you know what thing with a werewolf is you're not a werewolf all the time sometimes you're just a regular dude sometimes i'm just a regular dude but if i get caught out there in the full moon catch it i mean that, that's just how it go so i'm telling you man it's a good thing she only worried about me being this after the mingle she don't even really say too much about me going to the Sasua Strip because she know I'm probably going to go to Flip Flop a little while. I'm going to go walk on the beach. But, you know, she's she not really worrying about me with that because I'm not the type of dude. Now, I done dealt with the mangoes. I prefer to hunt. Now, I will deal with mango, but I prefer to hunt. So she knows that. So she know if I get loose somewhere, <laughs> she tries to stay with me, man. So I understand. But, brother, yeah, man, you come over here, man. 
you will find uh, some solid chicks, man, beautiful women. Uh, just don't don't come over here, man. You know how we say that, baby. If I pee in your rent, just chill out, have your fun, date a few women, hit some bars, go to Miami Bar, go to some restaurants, and you will meet somebody. And I still think you should visit Sasua. I think you should go visit Sasua. Has beaches. It had it had more than mangoes and stuff. Look, I think a lot of brothers be scared to go to Sasua because they know what's gonna happen to them. You know, I'm gonna tell you, it, it got me getting off the bus over there. I wasn't even trying, but. I understand, man, but that's part of your journey, part of your trip. Dating, having a good time is part of the journey, man. Nothing is wrong with it. And you will learn culture. You will. You go anywhere long enough, your, your Spanish game get better. Life gets better. So look, man, many good things coming. Got some live streams coming. I got a video, Can You Live for $1,000 or under? About to drop a lot of videos, man. So many good things, man join the channel i'm telling you and if you want to support the channel uh dollar sign and rolling the uh, traveler um, I, I appreciate you guys man we are out